GameFi is one of the most exciting areas of Web3 and it is defined as the intersection between traditional gaming and decentralized finance. The gaming sector has grown to become really big where uh, gaming companies hold all the cards with gamers playing games and paying to play and user generated content belonging to the big corporations. Web3 Gaming came to change all of this and give privacy to gamers, give decentralization to them, to gamers and also help gamers also become shareholders, become part and parcel, become an integral part of this Web3 Gaming process. Elfin Kingdom on its own is a gaming project that has come to become really big. Started from somewhere and now it is really big. When I mean really big, it is really big because I've seen a thinking of where it was when it started before to the point that, uh, that it grew and started having more games added to it. And I can really say that a thinking of is really redefining game five. I believe it, I've seen it, and I know what I'm saying that a thinking of is really redefining the game five space. Now we also have to understand further that um, Elfin Kingdom on its own is a GameFi project that combines gamified aspects with decentralized finance, yield farming, and non-fungible tokens NFTs to create a play-to-earn platform that allows players gather, compete, and farm to increase their cryptocurrency earnings. Players in Elfin Kingdom select their own roles and decide how to make use of all available options. Every position can use a sophisticated approach to maximize its earning through an integrated banking system. I think you know, I create a gaming hub and platform to facilitate the integration of traditional and cryptocurrency mini games into the Elfin Kingdom ecosystem and provide a launch pad for their token and NFTs via Elfin Kingdom farming by IFOs. Really, the mission and vision of Elfin of, of Kingdom is directed towards creating a safe space where players can use players and users can spend their spare time, play and earn to become and also to become a place where all cryptocurrency lovers can spend their day playing and earning at the same time. Really, for Elfin Kingdom, it's really top notch. It's really a lot put together. And you see that the future of of GameFi is that which looks really bright, with analysts projecting and predicting that the growth of GameFi will 10x in the next three years. And also, bear in mind that we'll soon have the bull run, and a lot of things will be happening at that time. And I believe, really, I believe a lot that GameFi, the metaverse, NFTs will be key indicators that push the that push key narrative that will really push forward. The, the bull run. Just as it happened to Axe Infinity, I feel that it will happen to a thinking Kingdom. Hence, being being um, a contributor, being a part of the Elfin Kingdom ecosystem at this point is really important. When we have the Elfin Kingdom token, the Elfin will be able to stake it, do a lot of things with it. And it always bothered me. I wanted to know how I, w- I wanted to know how um, Game 5 projects make money. How do they make their money? I did some research and I found out that they can make money in several ways, several ways to make money from in-game purchases being tasked, being tasked, and also in-game advancement can require specific assets, which you have to buy a token, buy an, buy an NFT, hold a number of tokens to go further to the next stage. And blockchain games will often charge for any competitive element they run on a regular basis. So I saw all this and I just fell in love with it. That many game five platforms are free to play. So introducing in-game NFTs helps generate liquidity. However, projects can use projects can earn revenue in many ways. Projects can earn revenue in many ways. Forgive that on my screen. In many ways, including direct investment in a native token. So it's it's it is a really cool call to give now. Uh, we should look forward to holding the Elfin token. I'm getting much of them as I could, as I couldn't join the um, the process before.
but that would be nice to hold it now. Now we start playing the game. Play the game. Play the game. I hope I don't get beaten in this game. Okay, these guys are really strong. My elfins are stronger. My elfins are magical. My elfins do a lot. I'm gonna summon more elfins and, and and I will play to beat my opponent. All of them, beating them all together. Beating them all together. All together. You read that combining of it not only levels you up, but it helps you to defeat obstacles. So when you combine them, you get rid of obstacles to get more spaces on board and get some other diamond rewards. So the more you beat your opponents, the more rewards you're getting. We fight now. We fight now. We fight now. Battle for who is fitter? This guy, this guy, the body size, the body size can be really intimidating. But my friends are not scared. My friends are capable. They are ready to win them. Shoot them off. Oh yes, shoot them off. Shoot them off. Shoot them off. We're winning already. And we win. We win. We win. That's more like it. We go again. Another round. Another round. Another round. Maybe here in this game, <laughs> he that lives to that fight and runs doesn't live to fight another here. So we fight it all till the end without running away from anyone. Without running from anyone, we fight it all till the end. It's a very clear process. A very clear process. A very clear process. Just to chip in quickly that blockchain gaming really has other benefits has a benefit that tends towards relaxation towards having you um having you be a better person because of gaming which i will share soon now we go to the final round we go to the final round Summon my offering soon. And I hope to win this round. To win this round. You know, blockchain gaming speeds up the response to things that happen around you. It makes you sharper, it makes you more active. It encourages teamwork among players. Just that we have the um, gaming guild. It stimulates creativity, focus, and enhances your visual memory. It also improves strategy and leadership and helps to teach new languages and has a key role to play in critical thinking where it enhances your critical mind, your, your creative mind to come forth. So those are part of the benefits of blockchain gaming, really. This is the round that will precede the final round where we'll be battling a dragon. Battling a dragon. You have to have good networks to play with three games, you know else some things can happen after this round you're battling a dragon <laughs> i guess you're excited because it's really going to be it's going to be a tough one but i don't know who's going to win i don't know who's going to win but i hope to win i hope to win i hope to win, I hope to win really. let's go that guy is really strong we <laughs> dream away he was strong, but I think we are stronger.
it's now time to battle the dragon. I am ready, really ready to have this fight and win this fight. And I'm hoping that the gods of games are behind my back. You can see how I have I used all my diamonds to get elf wings because I really want to win. I don't want to carry a stigma that I couldn't win the fight with the dragon and move to the next level. I was fighting the boss. So we're getting ready to I'm pairing up my elf wings, making them stronger, making them have more, more vitality, making them have more um, more power to defeat the enemy. And uh, <clears throat> the enemy is waiting and they're observing. The dragon is three-headed dragon that spits raw fire. And it's really going to be a wonderful match as about to start now. My elf wings are better and they want to finish the Small guys first of all, the head there is finishing me with my offense, I can finish him with him. He's killing my offense, he will kill this guy. Whoa, 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 that's massive. My offense is almost gone, almost gone, almost gone. Let's see, we go to be victorious, we go to be victorious, she needs to run. Whoa, the dragon is down and won, and we won, and we won, and we won. That's how big it is. Just, just by recap. As I said before that gaming helps you speed up your response to things around you, encourages teamwork, and it helps stimulate creativity, focus, and visual memory. It also improves leadership and strategy and helps your critical thinking. Thank you for staying with me and make sure you try out your thinking. Check the link in the bio.